Welcome to Vlogmas Stage 20. some more presents I wrapped this morning because last night I was just a bit tired and it was a bit late um I know they don't look the best all of them but they are qu quite a lot of these are quite hard presents to wrap this is probably my neatest one because of how easy it was but this is for um my mum's mum and dad so my granddad and grandma on my mum's side of the family <laughs> grandma so my dad's mum and dad you may think that is like nothing compared to what my other grand and grandma have that's because my dad is buying them some vouchers for a dishwasher or something like that so they've just got some little chocolates to go with batches because everyone likes to open a present so i didn't do a time lapse of wrapping up my dad's presents because i've done toast so many time lapses all the memory is full so these are the presents from my mum to my dad there's two books and so and marnie aftershave gift set um, and I'm wrapping all my presents up for my family and friends on Tuesday, so look forward to that in Vlogmas Day 22. Hi everyone, so ex excuse my face, no makeup and my hair is bunged up and needs to be washed. But I'm just going to start exercising, so I'm in my gear and I'm going to go on the treadmill, I'm going to do an ab workout, I'm going to do a fine butt workout and then I'm going to do my sit-up routine that I used to do. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be exercising every single day now, which is only... Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, which is five days before Christmas. Obviously, I'm not on Christmas Day, and hopefully I can be a little bit better in shape by Christmas Day because I just want to feel very healthy. Well, not healthy, but I just want to feel very good about myself on Christmas Day. And exercising is proven to make you happy, so that's why I'm going to. As you can hear, I'm listening to Michael Jackson and what is this bit of hair sticking up doing? I've just done a 10 minutes on the treadmill and now I'm going to do an ab workout and a fine book workout but I can't show you that because I'm actually watching the video on my iPod so the videos I use I'm link below. So my hair looks even worse than it did after the treadmill. So I've just done the two workout exercises which have worn me out so much and then I've just done 20 sit-ups, 10 crunches, 10 leg raises and a 30 second plank and I'm just cooling down cooling down yeah that's the right word for it warming down whatever it is because I can tell my legs are going to wake tomorrow so I'm going to do some stretches now So I've got my candles lit, my bath is running and then I'm about to put my two lush products in and I'm going to use the vest. So the two left that I've got of the five gold rings which is a vanilla she butter scent 
very moisturising and it's just like a gold glitter. And then I'm using my only bath melt from the Christmas collection. It's the Snow Angel and it's cocoa butter with marzipan scent, which I can't wait to see how that smells because obviously marzipan is something you normally have in a cake. Um, it's supposed to be very moisturising. Oh, it smells amazing. I probably look like 10 times worse than I did in the last clip because I bung my hair up in a bun and it just looked absolutely dreadful but oh well I will finish on no I will carry on with the clip um so that's my that was my tea no my lunch that I had about two hours ago and it was so 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 nice and it was like a Christmas dinner come early every single time I have a roast dinner like in the winter season I just feel like it's an early Christmas dinner which is a very good thing, it was very nice and I just realised I never gave you my products on my Lush products that I used in my bath so the 5 gold rings which I used 2 of them so I've used them all up now which I have reviewed quickly before but I will say again if you haven't watched the vlog that they were in um, so my views are in it, doesn't, you can't smell them, doesn't leave a pretty sight, it turns your bath orange but it does leave your skin really moisturised then my view on the snow angel is the smell is amazing it's the only lush product i've actually used that i can actually smell the smell once it's in the bath so that is amazing marzipan scent um again it leaves your skin really moisturized but the look isn't exactly the nicest when it's just like fizzed it looks quite pretty but then when it all like mixes into the bath it turns to your bath all yellowy and orange um which looks like someone's weed in the bath so it's not a very nice sight um the moisturising effects are nice but I probably wouldn't buy any of the two products again so what has happened to my hair now I don't have a flipping clue it's because I've been lying down but I'm just waiting for the apprentice final to come on I think it's coming on in about 10 minutes and they have uploaded the autumn primark call and already it's got like 20 views which is like fast considering it's only been up like an hour obviously it's not a lot for big youtubers but um for me it is and then I've edited my the Lush haul, so if you haven't seen that, I will also link it below. And then my laptop decided to shut down whilst it was saving. So, I think it's all saved, because it's I've just had to restart it. Because sometimes my laptop decides to do stupid crash jumps, crash jumps, crash dumps, and, like, closes all the files up. So, it's, it's saved, which is good, and... Now I'm just going to process it before I upload it to YouTube. So about 15 minutes into The Apprentice, I predicted that Varna would win and I'm sticking to my decision. So obviously if you watch it and you're watching my vlog now, you would have known who won. But if you still haven't watched it, then I advise you not to watch the next clip because it will be my reaction to whoever the winner is. But I don't mind who wins because I think Joseph and Varna both equally deserve it. But Joseph has been one of my favourite contestants throughout the process. But I don't know actually, I think Joseph now, because I've just watched his pitch, looks so much better than Varna's. But I don't know now, hmm. So Joseph won and I'm so happy for him, so obviously my prediction was wrong. But at the last moment, like two minutes before, not two minutes, like literally two seconds before he announced it, and Lord Sugar was like, he loves technology, technology he's always been with technology for like 50 years and all that i thought he's he's gonna say okay he wants to change he's gonna go with joseph and he did so I've, i'm not saying that i predicted it because in no way i didn't i said varna but i'm saying in the last minute i changed my mind but that doesn't really count um but yeah i'm so happy for joseph anyway and i still think varna will probably still try and go through with a plan and i think sometime either her app will become an app so I've took my hair down from a bun and it actually looks quite nice apart from it being really greasy but it's a bit too late to wash it now so I'm just going to get up even earlier in the morning and wash it then because you may think it's disgusting but I'm not exactly going anywhere from now till when I'm sleeping till when I wake up first thing in the morning um, and I've just realised yeah it's 2 minutes till 12 um, so I'm going to wrap up today's vlog I'm going to quickly show you what I got in Today's from about 7 advent calendar if I can find it and so far it's the most happiest I think I've been with a products because I completely forgot that these were in here. It's some number 7, obviously it's number 7, uh, eyelash curlers, 
they look absolutely lovely and they're so pretty the gold obviously the ones i have at the minute are just some super jug own cheap ones that are silver but they just look so pretty and these honestly when i saw them i was so 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 happy because I really like my eyelashes curl. And if a lot of you who know me personally know, I love to have lengthy eyelashes. So I'm really, really pleased with that. And I, like I said, I'm going to finish today now because it's like, yeah, tomorrow in like one minute. But I'm still going to carry on editing. I've now uploaded um, today a winter primark call, a lush haul, vlogmas day seven, and now editing vlogmas day eight. And I'm going to upload that and I'll. I'm going to also edit Vlogmas Day 9 and upload that and then I'm going to go to bed. So it's probably going to be, be quite a late night as it is already but oh well that's what happens when you get really behind on editing. So I'll see you tomorrow when I did promise today that there'll be like cooking videos and decorating room but I've had to end up just editing um, and doing other stuff instead. But tomorrow there'll be definitely cooking um, and filming videos and room decorations. So I'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 21 when it'll be four days till Christmas.